Hi, I just want to make this little video for you, dear friend, about the power of your mind of, of pretending, imagining, and using, using your mind in a very funny, outrageous way almost. And this can apply to people, anyone who's, who you think is a thorn in your life, a problem, a hard thing in your life, or any challenge, challenging situation in your life, ill health, money, whatever. So the example I'm going to use is over here, there's like loads of flies on the wall, loads of fruit flies. And when I opened under here before, which is nice and clean now, it wasn't clean before. So I had to, loads and loads of flies left and flew out of my face and all around the room. So here's the, here's the thing, okay? Usually people might get irritated or upset with a whole lot of like millions of fruit flies in their house. But I cleaned the place so they're gonna really reduce the numbers now and diminish. But for the moment, now here's what I did with my mind, okay? I switched my thoughts completely. I started to play with it and have fun. I said, ah, oh, look. And I said this to Sally who, who was mentioning about the flies. She wasn't complaining, thank God. She wasn't, didn't seem to be upset. <laughs> but she, she did a bit too many than she wanted, you know? And I'd rather have less as well. <laughs> especially have a clean house. But what I did was I said, welcome flies, oh, I love you guys, you're so lovely, I welcome you into my home, into my kitchen. Thank you for joining us and for gracing us with your presence. I hope you have a nice life here. I know it's only gonna be a day or, or two or something really silly that you live for, although you could say the human life duration is silly, but, uh, and theirs is normal. <laughs> But um, I just said, yeah, 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 I know you're going to have, have a short life, but welcome, have fun, enjoy, enjoy yourself here. Like, thanks for joining us, and uh, you're welcome. I, I hope you and your family, they're just, as I was saying to Sally, they're just with their friends and their family, their, their brothers and sisters, their moms and dads, their parents. So, so let's, you know, let's be kind and loving and welcoming to them while they live here, and they're going to be gone now, in reducing the numbers because they die very quickly. And because I cleaned the place because they hatch on the fruit skins, etc. So the thing is, when you do that, suddenly what, what happens is, you're friends with the flies, you're friends, you're friends, and you've made peace, and you've actually opened your heart, and even gone out to welcome the, the, the thorn in your life. So if you have any thorns in your life who are people, you can start to outrageously switch and flip your thoughts about them. Let's say you're afraid of traveling, or you're moving to a new country, and you're anxious, or you've lost your job, or you've low money, you're anxious, you switch, say, oh, thank God for all the abundance coming into my life, like, I'm going to have a great trip, everything, or you're meeting a new relationship partner or something, oh, everything is, everything's, everything's going to work out it's so smoothly, it's going to be fun, it's going to be easy, it's going to be, like, easy going, it's not going to be complicated, it's not going to be, like, too difficult or too problematic, I'm going to cope well with it. So some people could, you could call these affirmations if you wanted. So I'm going to cope well, I'm going to be, I'm going to be good, but it's, it's going to be smooth. I'm going to be guided, like thank God for that. I'm gonna, my health is coming back to me, like I'm going to be strong. But even if, it's, even if I'm not, even if I'm like tired, etc., I'm still going to like try and have fun and be silly and make the most of it anyway. So get outrageous with your thinking in an outrageously positive way, but not like fake way. Not, not, not a false way. You can be true, true way, positive, but not act, not like denying, not denial, positive but real. So yeah, you are gonna have fun and be be strong and and enjoy life no matter what. And and there's every chance like the things that we're anxious about actually do turn out smooth smoothly. So imagining and pretending things to be all hunky dory is actually good and we can equip and do what ourselves and do what's necessary for what we need to do to help us in the situation if it's not smooth too so we're taking care of our responsibilities and doing what we need to do but at the same time when when it's beyond there's nothing else we can do then we start to think think outrageously positive also like even more so and a little bit goes a long way for example i was a little bit like slightly apprehensive or anxious about something the other day i was like thinking mm, i hope this works out okay and then i just started saying hey it's gonna be smooth i'm sort of thinking it's gonna be smooth it's gonna be easy it's gonna work out really no problems no no big deal for me and then it was actually even more smoother than i could ever have imagined like just instead of something possibly turning out to be complicated or, or very long to to do in my life 
it turned out to be took a minute or two with no complications. <laughs> so if you're if you can use it, you can use this. You can use it in your life if you're having an argument or bad feelings with somebody. If you've had a clash or a collision, um, you can say. And you can imagine and pretend in your mind that the next time you meet this person, it's going to be fantastic, that they're going to be all happy and smiling and friendly to you, that maybe they'll thank you or they'll say sorry to you, and they'll be much warmer from the heart, and that's because they're looking over and learning. Um, and they're, you can imagine and pretend that they're processing things now in the meantime, and that they're, 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 they're turning out to be happier towards you and more friendly and kinder in their hearts towards you, in their feelings towards you. Or if you worry about exams or anything in the future, you can just imagine it turning out well, like it'll be fine, it'll be good, it'll be great. And then just enjoy the now again and and just have fun in life. And just it's just the earth game. We're just playing the earth game here. So that's what my job is. Help people that really have massive more joy and happiness, enjoyment of the earth game. For me to learn the earth game, what you could call grow wiser and help other people become wiser and more aware and empowered to play the earth game and just to know a bit about the, the real life <laughs> beyond the earth game, you know, the spirit world, the, the real world where this is like the earth game that, this, that the souls and the spirits play, that we are. And the earth game is not just earth it's the whole physical manifested world of the universe like galaxies and universes and all the rocks in space so that's all the physical world and we're part of that but underneath we're souls so that's the that's the truth we can't die etc so it's just playing the earth game here learning growing expanding and creating so that's it have fun have a lovely day peace and have fun with your mind <laughs> fun madness huge tremendous outrageous, realistic and positive, good feeling, thoughts, imagination and pretending and this is very very powerful. For example one more thing maybe, let's say you're uptight about people looking at you, ask yourself well pretend what would you do if there's no one else around here now? Would you be more or would you roll up your sleeves and relax and let your hair down maybe dance or something or whistle? So if you're out in public and you're self-conscious, well what? Imagine no, no, pretend everyone like likes you, pretend everybody agrees, like is favourable towards you. Pretend people are going to love it, love you, if you're giving a talk, pretend, yeah it's going to be great. The presentation, yeah, yeah it's going to be awesome, it's going to be fine, people will love you. Imagine like people like being really extremely favourable towards you. Or if you're, if you're like, if, you, if you'd like to do a cartwheel flip and you're afraid, think well what would I do if I was on my own in a forest or if there's no one else around and then you can say yeah I'd probably do the cartwheel. Like, who, <laughs> what would it matter in another hundred years if I did a cartwheel or whatever else? You can apply to anything, okay? So, apply this like positive imagination and pretending with your family members, your workmates, schoolmates, and anything in life. And uh, that's it. So, have fun. Uh, peace, love, light to you. Welcome to share and subscribe and to like and to comment. And let me know your like really inspired thoughts, okay? Thanks. Bye.